Hello and welcome to AP Biology for the 2015-16 academic year. Um, I first of all hope you are having a great summer doing lots of fun things or relaxing things or whatever you like and um, I also hope you're excited about the coming school year. Uh, for most of you, that means you're probably seniors. Uh, so big last year for you. If you're junior, I'm sorry. I don't mean to hurt your feelings, um, but uh, you probably will be outnumbered. Uh, at any rate, uh, your summer assignments are on their way for you. Sorry for the delayed start. Uh, had big things happening at the beginning of the summer, and so I'm finally getting around to posting them. Um, so let me, okay, um, your summer assignment has five parts, okay? Uh, the first of those is to sign into our Admodo group, which good news is you have probably already done that. Um, you, at the end of the last school year, got a little slip of paper and it had an Edmodo code on it saying, hey, looks like you're going to take AP Bio and please sign into our group. Um, if you haven't, uh, uh, here's a reminder, of course, if you haven't done that, you probably do not know that this video even exists, but the code is X9DRGD. Um, <clears throat> if you um, know of someone who might have signed up late for the course and maybe didn't get the slip at the end of the school year, um, spread the word that it's there and, and share it with them uh, or just tell them to email me or whatever. Uh, it may make you request to join at this point because the group is locked, but I'll approve you uh, if it doesn't work or if for any reason you need to contact me uh, about a summer assignment or whatever, please just use this email. It's Julia, J-U-L-I-A underscore Coleman at ccpsnet.com. Whoops, and I did leave off part, net dot net, okay? Um, <clears throat> and, um, and I will get back to you as quickly as I can. Um, now, there are, as I said, five parts. The first part you've probably already done, so smooth sailing. The second part gets into a little bit of more serious academic part, um, which is to watch some podcasts on evolution. I call them evolution light because we will get a much more in-depth evolution later in the course. But evolution is the foundation upon which biology rests. And we must have a really strong understanding of that going into the course. So I want you to get a review of what evolution says. Um, and the link for these podcasts will always be, uh, unless something changes when we get our Chromebooks and so on, will be on Edmodo. Right now they are on YouTube. That will not work when we get our Chromebooks unless something changes. But for now, all of the videos that you need will be on YouTube. Uh, my YouTube channel is Coleman Bio but again, the links will be on Edmodo. Uh, also on Edmodo is a handout. So what you will do is you will watch the videos and then you will do uh, use the handout to, to write down answers in response to the video. I would prefer that you did this the old fashioned way. That is print it out, write on it, write the handout and turn it in the first day we have class. Um, Research shows that students retain more from actually physically writing things down than from typing while you're watching, taking notes or whatever. However, if you don't have access to a printer or you just feel it's better for you to do it electronically and turn it in via Edmodo, I'm certainly not going to say you cannot do that in this day and age, but I think for most of us, it is more beneficial to do it the old fashioned way as far as actual learning is concerned. Now, a bit more about the podcast. You're going to be watching a lot of them. Sorry, but you will need to watch a lot of them. They are taking the place of classroom lecture and textbook reading. Of course, I will give you a textbook. Got plenty to use if you prefer. Um, <clears throat> but these are taking the place of lecture in the class. Uh, you will always do it in the same basic way. You'll get links to the to the podcasts on Edmodo, and you will get in the handout that you need to to complete. 
please note you really, really do need to actually watch them. This is not just a suggested supplementary activity. This is the meat of the course upon which we will build in class. Um, it is doing the, the crude note taking outside of class that will allow us to dive more in depth and, and, and do more meaningful activities when we are in class together. Um, so please use the podcast to your advantage. It is so much better than me just giving notes in class. You can stop, start, fast forward, rewind, whatever you want to do when you've got that YouTube or, or whatever format right in front of you. If you're bored, take a break. Don't just keep powering through something. Take a break. Uh, if you miss something, rewind it. If you didn't understand something, rewind it. Sometimes that actually helps. Uh, if you already know stuff, fast forward. Um, you are in charge of those, those videos in a way that sometimes we don't feel comfortable being in charge in class. We don't always feel comfortable saying, hey, wait, back up. I didn't get that. Some people do. Some people don't. Um, you certainly can't fast forward me uh, as much as you might want to in class. So you're in charge take advantage of that power, okay? Um, and please, 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 above all, do not procrastinate and save all the podcasts till the night before a test. That is not what they are intended to do, okay? Please do them as they are assigned. All right, back to what we were doing. So summer assignment has five parts. First part, check, Edmodo Group. Second part, the uh, Evolution Podcast. Um, the third part, uh, please read a portion of a book. It's a great book. You can read the whole thing if you want, but you are not required to. You are required to only read the introduction to this book called Survival of the Sickest um, and the first chapter. That's it. Uh, you will get an amazing amount of really useful insight from those two small pieces. The whole book's well worth reading, but those are the only two parts that I would like you to read. Now, how do you get this book? You can certainly purchase it if you wish. It's certainly worthwhile to have it uh, from Barnes & Noble, Amazon, readily available, not very expensive. But it is also available in the Chesterfield County Public Library. Um, and it is probably the way most of you will access it. It's available for free online at a link that I will provide on Edmodo. So online reading as well. Um, now, that's three parts. So Evolution Light, Edmodo Group, reading. The fourth part is to do our animal behavior unit. This is what's going to take up most of your time of all the things is this one. This is where we're going to jump in when we start uh, the year off. Uh, it's the same routine as the Evolution podcast. You're going to watch podcasts, complete handouts. It's just there's more of them and they are longer. This is a, a beefier unit. Uh, the links will be on Edmodo that you need. It's a, it's a great unit. It's really interesting. Um, I think you'll like it, except for that it will take up your time. Um, again, same as Evolution. I prefer you did the handouts by hand, but it is a lot to print out. So if you would um, rather do it electronically, that's okay. I think you will retain more and get more out of it if you do it the old-fashioned way. But that's not required. Um, so the last of our five parts is that you will learn some birds. Um, I'm going to give you three short podcasts in which you're going to learn in each pocket a set of six birds. Um, you'll learn their visual identification and their song identification. Yes, we can identify birds by their voice as well. Um, and then you'll take some simple online quizzes that you will be able to retake until you get them perfect. Um, if you've had me before, these birds hopefully will be review for you mostly. Uh, if you haven't had me before, you might be like, why in the world are we doing this? Because biology is all around us. It is outside. It is inside. It is everywhere. And I want you to just have your eyes pop and start recognizing all of this magnificent life that is, shares this earth with us. So this is the way... One of the ways I, I get at that is, is helping you notice some birds outside. Um, okay, so uh, that's pretty much it uh, for this little video. Um, and if you have any question, please don't hesitate to contact me. Email is probably the easiest way, uh, but uh, 
whatever works for you, uh, messaging through Edmodo or whatever. So thanks a lot for watching. Really looking forward to the fall, but not until after we've had a lot of good, 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 good summer uh, between now and then. So have a great rest of your summer. Let me know if there's anything I can do. I will be posting podcasts. Uh, and uh, so check into Edmodo regularly. Um, thanks a lot for watching. Take care and I will see you soon.